Now that is a sight I will never tire of seeing. We'd best not keep them waiting. Tanks full. Food to check. Top down. Here loading. We are prepared to go. Anything else? If this goes to shit, we need to break Looks like everyone's down. ready. As ready as they can be. It's not your usual raid. First for many. Mitch probably roused them. Feel that? The tension? It means they've realized what they're stepping into. I just got back from doing some reconnaissance. I want to see this. Get any sleep at all? The older you get, the less you need. Besides, I wouldn't have slept a wink for a raid like this. And good intel is just better than a good night's sleep. Take a gander. Thanks. The plan is simple. We have two objectives. One, get into Arasaka Tower and assist V in accessing Mikoshi. And two, take advantage of the confusion to gather as much equipment as we can. Prizes like that will see to our cash flow problem. The only way into Mikoshi is to dig through to Arasaka Tower's underground levels. Which means we have to hit the Maglev Tunnel construction site and hijack the Night Corp Cirque. Last but not least, intel from our recon drone has showed us a couple of weak points. This valley leads to the site. I doubt they'll be expecting trouble there. All the same, we'll want to move quickly. Time is of the essence. We can't allow the guards to call for backup. And if we're too slow? That'll be a job for Bob and his jammer. We'll just have to get close to their comms antenna and start transmitting. Let's not kid ourselves. It won't stall them for long. Let's hope it keeps them busy just long enough. Are there drones there? Early detection systems? Anything? It's not Fort Knox, yet Night Corp is using Militech for security, so you never know. I guarantee you they're patrolling the area. In any case, our drones will match theirs. Teddy will be on the lookout to raise the red flag. Site's walled in. Are Panzer's gun big enough for that gate? You bet your ass it is. Sounds good so far. What else? Once you're inside, you'll need to reach the Cirque and get it to do your bidding. Enter Mitch and Carol. Get that drill up and running, and the road to the cellars of Arasaka Tower will be wide open. From there, V, Pan Am, and I will get to the laboratory and find a way into Mikoshi. And while we're drilling in, should we expect anyone to crash our party? If everything goes as planned, nobody should know where we are or what we plan to do. Feel free to look around more if you want. We still have some time left. I think I've seen enough. Well, that about does it. V, you ready? How we get back from there? The same way we'll go in. And fast, both ways. Our people will try to hold the road while we're inside. So V, you ready? Ready as I'll ever be. Is everyone up to speed? Start your engines, folks.
reading loud and clear. I've got us on a group channel. Coming to you live from the Badlands. This is your home. Teddy. All right, all right. Did you fire up that drone? The little bird is humming away. Trespassing on property protected by Militech Site Secure. Turn back now. I repeat, turn your vehicles around. This is getting dicey. Your turn, Bobby. Do you remember the jammer? Sure do. We're on it. Got speed. Pan Am, did you check if all systems are operational? Checking. Nitro injector clear. Launcher's also green. We're good to go. Then let the fun begin. Get those things out. All systems are offline. <laughs> Shit! Something's busted. All the circuitry is dead. I'll try to work it out. But V, you need to somehow get rid of those drones! On the drones! You deal with the Panzer! No, no, no! Fire in the cockpit! Got the power surge! You got it? Can you put it out? Get the fuck out of not! Christ, people, where are you? I'm out here by the transmitter. What's the hold up? Pan Am, how's it looking? ETA! A minute! Fire's under control. Switching to emergency power. A couple of systems will be analog, but she should be mobile. That's Rumble a mistake. Ahead. Right. So, they know we're coming. Don't deploy it, headed straight forward. We need more time, Bobby. Can you hold them off? Do I have a choice? Look after yourself. Oh, Bobby's got me. Like I said she would. Propulsion, weapon systems, launchers, all falling like dominoes. There anything you can do about it? I'll try. Either I do this, or this rattle trap will really be scrap. You get out. Help our folks. We'll provide cover. Just hurry, all right? Copy that. There's likely a control room upstairs we can link remotely to the circ from there. That's a mistake. You're right. I 
I got a terminal. We're jacking in. What about security protocols? V, it's not a space station. It's a dumb big-ass drill. Don't worry. Carol will slice through it like butter. All right, we're firing up the Cirque. Aiming to bore through to Arasaka Tower. This will take some time. V, we'll need you to cover us. Got company. A lot of it, too. V, help us out here! Fucking Militech is not letting up! Damn. It's looking like the drill vector's on auto. Brace yourselves! How can we possibly turn? We're gonna sweep up this bitch into it. Mitch, kill that autopilot and hit manual override. Got it. It's working! Prepare for takeoff! Watch out! Oh, from the right! Oh, oh. God, Mitch! Eleven percent! Shit! Can't you speed it up? Our hands are tied! buy you as much time as we can. Much obliged. We'll keep watch over Mitch and Carol and see to that gate. The military. We have to intercept before it reaches the others. Goddamn. More company incoming. We'll handle them. Just hit 
Knight Core Vice. Peril's cutting through. It's slow work, but it'll get done. Where are you all at? Need to slide firm of the land and secure tight. Try to figure out where to place the charges, but we need more time. There's no thumb twiddling going on here. We'll buy you as much time as we can. Hang it! Holy shit! We did it! They're smoldering wrecks. We did that! Saul, Mitch, head back your way. After that display, you can be sure there's a place for you in the Panzer Boy ranks. Saul's right. Harold, you and Cassidy keep us secure here. You got it. Mitch, you're coming with us. Ma'am, yes, ma'am. No time to lose that. Let's go. Okay. I'm putting it on autopilot and disconnecting. Okay. Is everything all right? You seem quiet. Bob and Teddy are dead. And it's my fault. Teddy and Bob, they knew the risks, V. Everyone knows. So do I. And if you'd known how this would turn out... I'd do it all over again. For anyone in the clan. Saul told me you brought in some help from Akoshi. Someone from the outside. Mm-hmm. Alt. And who is that? Alt's an AI. Roguish. You're getting help from an AI? Well, nothing can surprise me now. Only one capable of breaking into Arasaka's systems. And we wouldn't get into Mikoshi without her? Well, we sure as hell wouldn't get out. You trust her? This alt? Yeah, she'll help us. Why? Something got you worried? I trust you. That's all I'll say. By extension, I trust this alt won't pull any rugs out from under us. Things will work out. They gotta... come too far for him not to. This would be it. How much farther to our Osaka Tower? Not far. It should be easy sledding from here. Shit. Do you see them? I think something's wrong. You should be used to this by now, Saul. Things rarely go as planned. We have no idea what's waiting for us inside. Fellas, what's the issue? Carol and the rest. Militech's all rattled up. Cut them off. They won't last long on that site. Jesus Christ. I'm taking the Panzer. They need all the help they can get. Are you out of your mind? The answer is no. You can't operate the Panzer alone without frying that gonk brain of yours. Do you have a better idea? They're family, Pan. I'm not leaving them behind. Saul, are you on board with this? V, someone make him see reason. Mitch is right. The three of us have still got a decent shot. But without him, they've got none. You're sure about this? Saul! We're talking goddamn suicide! Look out for yourselves! They'll kill you! I'll catch you later. Saul! Carol! He's... I'm heading your way! Hang They're in gonna... there! We can't. You'll owe me a All beer this after this! Nothing. You two go on up and see what's gotten into her. Once you're mobile, I'll follow. Secure the rear. V. Let's go. The engine overheated and choked when drill bit met reinforced concrete. Bypassing should override the emergency system shutdown. Lift it. I'll use my personal link if needed. We don't have time, V! Come Moment of truth. Here it goes. Modern 
Everything all right? Pan Am, talk to me. No, 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 Pan Am. I'm here. I'm a bit bruised is all. I've endured worse. Pan Am, for a sec I thought you'd... It's okay, V. Everything's okay. Saul. The tunnel's clear for now. Any word from Mitch? Still nothing. I knew it. it could be a problem with the comms. Hmm. Mm -hmm. Come on. Let's finish this. What's this? Seismic dampers. They're designed to protect buildings against earthquakes. These are still below the basement. Right. We have to find a way to a level higher up. happened to be standing right where the AHQ bomb left a huge crater. Then isn't this place positively saturated with radiation? Who knows? Great. We'll find out. I see something there. The guards need our attention first. Don't like this. Not one bit. V, take, take care of the sentries. Silently. Sure sounds care. it. We'll be here till sundown at least. It always like this around here? Nah, almost never. That's why I don't like it. trickier than we expected. Their systems must have detected vibrations under the building when we drilled through. All units are on alert, which means instant cutoff of all passages, like rats in a cage. Mikoshi, a ways to go still? No, the lab is in the next sector over, but we need to get there first. Where exactly are we? Plant and services level, and it's where we'll stay if we don't disable security. Are there any access points? Gotta get to one stat. I'm looking. Give me a sec. I found one. It's not far. You can jack in your personal there. Okay. Better hope there's a port for all charred too. I'm sending you the shortest route. Uh, we need to lift this goddamn lockdown first. Just keep your heads down. Nobody needs to know about our little visit in here. Initiated. All 
employees are to remain where they are until the lockdown has been lifted. Okay, I'm here. Alt, the shard's in. Yes. How much time do you need to... It is done. Well, I'll be dead. Well, yes! It worked! So we can keep going to Makoshi. Your path lies open. Still alive, you two. For now. Good. I'm ready. Likewise. Let's move. Saul? Mm -hmm. I feel it too. Something's a mess. It's the hush. Does anyone else have the chills? Something happened. This is a cold black! Cold black! They can't Everyone, run. run! She turned the car into a death trap. It seems you're all taking on prisoners. Guard tried to evacuate the Non-combatants. They didn't have to die. I think this is it. We made it. A few steps is all that separates you from Mikoshi. It seems you'll finally get your chance. We're with you, V. To the very end. The Aldecaldos always keep their word. It can't be much further, can it? <coughs> we have the room past the partition, then we'll be at the core. Oh, I, I can't.
Smasher, I remember you. Promised to kill Silverhand once. Gonna let you in on a little secret. Johnny? He's here with us. Now, he can't talk, but I can feel him under my skin. What the fuck are you talking about? In the end, got you. Silverhand triumphs. Let us go then, you and I, when the evening is spread out against the sky, like a patient etherized upon a table. Let us go through certain half-deserted streets, the muttering retreats of restless nights in one-night cheap hotels, and sawdust restaurants and oyster shops. Streets that follow like a tedious argument of insidious intent to lead you to an overwhelming question. Oh, do not ask what is it. Let us go and make our visit.
Hey, Johnny. All packed, you wash out? Got your one-way ticket? This funny to you? You know, discovered one nice thing about becoming Johnny Silverhand. You stop giving the slimmest shit about Johnny Silverhand. That right. This mean you've already decided what comes next? Want a word with Alt first. Where is the wench? Haven't caught on yet, have you? What? What do you mean? Alt's already split us. Once you jacked into Makoshi, she lit you up with Soul Killer. Your output don't fuck around. I am not his girlfriend. Too bad. Johnny could have used someone like you by his side. Strong words from a fellow construct stuck in the same Arasaka prison. Wait, what? You mean to say I'm an engram? Uh huh. Same as me. Got any more jokes? Wait, hold on. I want to know what the hell happened to me exactly. I applied Soul Killer to separating your two psyches, thereby creating V's distinct construct. An added analgesic protocol precluded any perception of pain. I was unable to eliminate all the changes made through the Johnny Data incursion and override. But V's engram integrity remains high. Meaning you can transfer his psyche back into his brain? As if onto a blank, virgin partition. You two still plan to obliterate Mikoshi? Mm-hmm. It's gotta burn. What about everyone locked away there? I will free them. Take them with me. Cut the crap. You'll gobble them up like so many morsels of code. Make a part of you. As if they could hope for anything better. Come on. So that's really it. We're done. You kept your word. There is one aspect I failed to take into account. Alt? What? The body is a key factor in this transaction. DNA reconfiguration by the relic has progressed too far. Added to aggressive, invasive medications, the body's immune system attacking its own neurons... Christ, will you just skip to the end? After I transfer your construct into your body, you will die. It is inevitable. It is imminent. Are you absolutely sure? Check again. You shall live for about six months. Perhaps somewhat more. No, no, no. There's gotta be something. Something we haven't thought of. Your body will see you as an intruder. But it's my body! The biochips nanites have altered it permanently. The body is now Johnny. Alt, give us a minute. V and I need to talk. I can't... I can't believe it. Everything. All we did. It was pointless. I've had enough of this. Of everything. You most of all. Perfect. Cause we're sticking to the plan. I'm going with all fuck knows where. You're keeping your body. Where's she even gonna take you? Beyond the black wall. To become part of her. Whatever the hell that means. What's it like? Beyond the black wall. Assuming I don't lose my fucking mind. At least no one can ride my ass there. What about hanging around as a construct? Just... So we find another way. Finding another way would be making a deal with Sokka. I'll pass. Jesus. Be a shapeless shadow in a digital afterlife. I really think I'd rather die. It is freedom from the body's limitations, from the base worries of life and the world. It is a new perspective on all. No. We left with fading memories. We're sharing a bed, head splitting hangovers, sea breeze on my face. 
Sun's heat on my shoulders. So take no. back the six months you got left. Didn't think life was worth clinging to. Not at any price, anyway. Cause it is. Wrong. That light beyond the black wall. See? That's hope. Could be the flames of hell or heaven's grace. Might also be an engram reading code. But it's a promise of survival. We've learned how to turn into pure data. But an animal still crawls inside us. And its instinct to survive almost can't be extinguished. Yeah, that instinct's part of being human. But so is denying it. Is there really no other way? As I said, Johnny can retain the body, remain there, while you come with me. Guess I meant, I don't know, a happier ending for everyone involved. Here, for folks like us, wrong city, wrong people. Yet the right to make a choice you have earned, through will and endeavor. This bridge leads deeper into cyberspace. Cross it and permanently sever the connection with your body. The path to your body passes through that mortal well. I told you, I said I wanted you to have my body, but, but I can't do it, I'm sorry. For fuck's sake, defend yourself. You're not even trying. You know, you taught me to let go sometimes. Save my strength for one last big bang. Goodbye, Man, never stop fighting. Damn. Remember it well. Our beginnings. I did not know what to make of you then. And now you do? You'll not get any tearful confessions out of me. Yeah, it wouldn't be tearful. I know you. What I think of you now matters not at all. Tomorrow we will be elsewhere. We'll start everything anew. You and I. Ask me then. Can't hardly wait. Get ready, Arizona. Here we come. <laughs> Look at the city. Somewhere in there, those bastards from Arasaka are wondering how they lost everything. They'll figure it out one day. But we'll be long gone. They'll never find us. I can promise you that. 
I know. Perhaps that's why I need a good long look. One day this view will be a happy memory. About to turn on your heel and never to see the city again. I think that makes you happy right now. And you? Ready? Do you feel the road beckoning? It's possibly your last glance at those buildings. The quicker I forget the whole damn thing, the better. The city makes false promises. Many of them grand, doesn't it? Mm-hmm. If you see through them before you lose everything, then you're pretty damn lucky. Perhaps luck's with us now. Perhaps we're leaving just in time. Think it is. Think we are. Time to make up for things. Shit, V. You're bleeding again. Just a little blood, Pan Am. It's nothing. V, promise me. As soon as we arrive down south, we'll go to my contacts. We'll fix... whatever needs fixing. Won't lose me, Pan Am. I promise. But you'll have enough of me yet. Saul, once. Do you know what he told me? That anyone is truly free just once. When they know they have nothing to lose. Exactly. Next month, that's us. Got nothing to lose, and that's how we live. Let's get out of here. Sure. But V... Get a good look at the city. One last time. If you need to, I mean. I'll wait in the car. Well, Night City. Good night and good luck. This is rot. I've heard enough. Most of our people have already crossed. They'll wait for us on the other side. And our souvenirs from Makoshi? If we so much as approached the gates with tech like that, they would wipe us out without warning. We've checked. Arasaka has people at every border crossing. But we know a road less traveled. Just realized, here I am, clapping from Arasaka again. Don't you worry. We'll pass right under the bastards' noses. <laughs> we better. New beginnings can be rough. Don't you know it. There is one thing I will miss about Night City. What's that? The food. The tie on 7th and Haywood. The pierogies down by the docks. Mm. Seriously? You'll understand once you've ridden with us for a while. Just realized. Already bringing everything I could possibly miss. Fuck <laughs> me. You are a sweet talker, aren't you? <laughs> but it works, doesn't it? Say it. Say it works. It works. All too well. You're with me now. We will figure out and take care of that piece of shit in your head. I know. Night City or going to your granny's for cookies and milk? Got it or that storm will catch you. Screw you. 
Mitch, hey. Hey, V. Good to hear you, Chum. How's things? Give me a month and I'll be as good as new. I told you all I'd be fine, didn't I? Come on, Mitch. You weren't nearly that confident after Mikoshi. None of us were. He was in bed for weeks. A vegetable. It would have been the end of him if not for his synapses. Toughened. Made almost fry-proof in panzers back in the war. <laughs> Did save every one of our asses, though. Petty Saul's not with us. Or Teddy. Or Bobby. Or Scorpion. They would have kicked your ass out of whack after that move with the panzer. Then hugged you until you puked. I know, Pan Am, I know. Gave us all a chance at a new start. Let's not fuck it up. I'm glad you're with us, V. See you soon. I can smell the ozone, even through the air conditioning. It's that storm getting close. Okay, we've arrived. It's high time. Hey, Mitch. Hey, let's get the fuck out of here, shall we? Hey, how are things? Is everything arranged? Everything's almost set. So you found it? Where we thought it would be? All plans laid in in place. They are indeed. Come see us when you're done. We'll talk about the who, what, and how. To the plan. One more time. We won't take any official crossing. I think you know that, right? So there's this old smuggling tunnel. Forgotten. We'll aim to use that. It's near the wall. So you found a gate in the wall. Clever. Not in as much as under. It's one of those old smuggling tunnels. Thankfully, it's still open. It wasn't the easiest thing to locate after all these years. But now... Nothing can stop us now. Look, tunnel's cool and all, but we gotta get there first. And what about security up and down the border? Whole area's brimming with tech. Drones on perpetual patrol. Heavier stuff too, maybe. Don't worry. We know what's there and what to do about it. And Carol and Cassidy will keep the corpos off our tail. And nobody's likely to spot us. Sooner or later, the border guards will realize something's not right. But by the time they get around to it, we'll be far, far away. Plus, that storm's a true stroke of luck. It should cover our tracks. We'll need more than a storm to keep the corpos off our tail. Got bigger concerns than us. And even if they don't, just let them try and catch us. They'll regret it. Great. And once we've crossed, what then? We'll make for our meeting point, join the rest of our people there, then we'll move on towards Tucson. And once there... We call the shots, right? We know the roads like the back of our hand. And down in Arizona, we have some old favors to call in. <laughs> so even if I wanted to, I got nothing to worry about. Starting today, it's not all on your back. You're no longer alone, V. You'll get used to it. It's nice. Looks like I've got a debt of gratitude to pay now. Oh, come the fuck on. We're all riding in the same wagon. And thanks to you, we stole enough Arasaka tech to build an aircraft carrier. Believe me, on the list of those wanted dead or alive, our names are right under yours. Well, time to move, before that storm finds us.
We're ready. After you, Pan Am. Are we all set? Mm-hmm. So jack in. Let's get the hell out of here. You got it. This is your big new beginning. So you have to start it like a real nomad. Behind the proverbial wheel. Mostly go straight. Go around the bigger holes and don't lose the rest. Got it? I will deal with the nitro. The mix will go straight to the cylinders. If I don't sink it just right manually, it could blow us to bits. I think that's best avoided. Fuck. I just realized something. What? The border wall. It wasn't here when I was little. I never imagined it would be. But I had this inkling that everything was different up north. Some bright fucking future awaited me there. Yeah, I think I know what comes next. Once you wound up on the other side and nothing changed, you thought Night City was the answer. Everything would change there. Yes. You know the tale's end, too. I'm returning. Right back to where I started. Fuck. No. Might be the same place on the other side, same space, but you're different. Totally different. All in all, you're right. And I have you. And the rest of these clowns. Ready always. Then hit it! Home stretch! Full speed ahead! They've launched the drones! Carol! Cassidy! Get moving! Then heading west and activating the jammers. They've marked me. I'm turning east to get them off your tail. Go on, kids! See you on the other side. The Nitro is ready. Say goodbye to Night City. It's your last chance. Got nothing left to say. is yours. Let's ride. Exactly what you want. A new beginning. Don't slow down, Pan Am. Not yet.
perfect. All great, Pan Am. We're going home. life out there in the desert, getting some sun, some fresh air in those lungs. Don't forget to get yourself a checkup every once in a while. Any dust or dirt gets into that insulation, you're done. Of course, decent ripper is harder to find out there than a four-star hotel. So actually, how about you just stop by when you're back in the city, huh? Think I could swing a little discount for an old regular like you. Till next time, V. V, is it true what they say? You rolling around in the dirt with the Aldecaldos? Have you lost your mind, mijo? Didn't you get in enough trouble already, eh? My city was too boring for you. Estás loco, eh? Crazy, completely crazy. Just watch out for yourself, okay? Don't do anything stupid. Because I'm not going to a second funeral. Wait. If you want to see some old faces, don't forget to stop by Mama Wells, okay? Just give me a call before, and I'll make my special chilaquiles just for you. <laughs> Cuídate, V. Um, hey, V. I was just wondering how you've been. Haven't heard from you in a while. Still living large in Night City? I don't know. All I think about is dropping everything and leaving. <laughs> Yet, here I am, still. The city's like quicksand. The more you try to get out, the more it pulls you in. Once you're up to your knees, you're never getting out. Like, like Evelyn. Anyway, look out for yourself, okay? And call me sometime. Bye. Hey, V, listen, I don't think I'll make it back to camp tonight. Sandstorm's coming our way. No choice but to sit tight and hold it out. Just wanted to say... Uh, I know this isn't the first time. You know, that we had plans. Never realized how hard being a chief would be. It always looked so easy from the outside. I'm just... I'm so lucky to have you, V. You can't even begin to imagine how much it means to me. Storm's how... closing in! 30 seconds to blackout! Guess it's time to go. I'll make it up to you. I promise. V. Hey. Christ. That run we did. My heart's still pounding. A pack of nomads versus Arasaka. Oh, oh, oh. I mean, the odds were totally stacked against us. I didn't know if we'd get out alive. But hey, we made it. And you know why? Because you were the one leading the charge, V. The craziest, baddest merc from Pacifica to the Appalachians. I don't know what you're up to right now, what your plans are. But just remember, we've walked through hell and back with you, brother, anytime. Until next time, eh? Take care. Hey, Rogue here. I wanted to... Oh, voicemail. <laughs> Why not? V? I was wondering if you could pass a message along to Johnny. Two messages, actually. One, that he's an arrogant, egotistical son of a bitch. And second, that it was nice to talk to him again. Both of you, take care.
take care of yourselves. Okay? Hey, Pete, so funny thing just happened. Oh, fuck, fuck, sake. Voicemail again. Do you ever answer the phone? Like, ever? Seriously. I can get through to data term customer service faster than you. Uh, what did I even... Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You know that us cracks agent called me and asked if I would go on tour with them? At first, I was like, over my dead fucking body. But then I thought, hey, wait. I could actually be fine. So, uh, what else? Well, there's the latest gossip for you, if you even care. Call me back when you can, okay? Peace out! B, hey. So, here's the thing. A couple fellas from the 5th Precinct busted a shop selling illegal iron. Sawed-offs, stun guns, mustard gas canisters. Orders from on up were to blow it all to the ground. But then I thought, maybe there's a better way to use all this stuff for a good cause. I still remember what you did for us. For me and Randy. This city needs more people like you. I'm gonna make sure they're equipped. This one's on me, V. See you around. Before samurai committed to seppuku, they wrote to say a death poem. It contained their final thoughts about life, about death. I have read many of them of late. Some are truly works of beauty. Yet, I am not a samurai, so I bid you farewell with simple words. Rot in hell, Xero. Hey V, listen, I was just thinking about you, so I laid out a quick tarot. I know, I know the reading's not as strong without you here, but we haven't seen each other for so long and I... Well, one thing led to another. You know what I drew? The chariot, the lovers, and the sun. <laughs> Looks like you've got a good life ahead of you out in the Badlands. Good luck, V. Be free.